Last week, the Association of Southeast Asian Nations failed to agree on a concluding statement about territorial disputes with China over the West Philippine Sea. Some ASEAN envoys explained how Cambodia controlled the summit to keep the sensitive issue off the agenda. Carol Ramoran returns with this story. Foreign Affairs Secretary Albert Del Rosario tried to broach a code of conduct on the disputed West Philippine Sea at one of last week's Association of Southeast Asian Nations summit meetings. But before he could raise his point, his microphone went dead. Cambodian hosts said it was just a technical glitch. Several Southeast Asian diplomats also said Cambodia's foreign minister cut off the address of ASEAN Secretary General Surin Pitsuan as he tried to bring up territorial disputes in the West Philippine Sea. Many hinted these could be Cambodia's efforts to keep the issue off the table since it was a known ally of China. China, the Philippines, Vietnam, Taiwan, Malaysia, and Brunei all have rival claims over the oil-rich waters. China, however, claims all of the area and has refused any, quote, internationalization to solve the dispute. Diplomats who declined to be identified said Cambodia, which held this year's revolving ASEAN chairmanship, was the worst chair. They added that China effectively bought Cambodia's loyalty. ASEAN failed to make a joint communique since the host country refused to play the customary role in seeking an agreement among the 10 participating countries. This also made the diplomats to abandon their attempts to draft a maritime code of conduct between ASEAN and China. Carol Ramoran, Solar News.